Platinum! Now, you say this is good? Sega. It's pretty good. I've never heard of it. Uh, yeah, neither had I. It was pretty good. Well, it's good. got that star. What's the volume on the TV? It's at five. Okay. It's good. We're good. Alright, so I played this for a little bit. <clears throat> like maybe a half hour or an hour before I put it down. I'm like, oh, we're playing this. We could do a full LP of this. It would be super fun. What the hell? Vanquish. Are you in a space colony? Yep. <laughs> I love that. You switch between game and system and goes, whoa! Vanquish. Whoa! Vanquish! <laughs> Check that. Oh, that's just uh, the hard drive. Leaderboard options. options. No, okay. Uh, oh boy, I want to check. Yeah, subtitles are on. We're not on an SD TV. We're no. on an HD TV. That tells you how old this game is. Ooh. Wolf. Vanquish. Vanquish. Okay, we're gonna hit a new game. All right. You will lose previous safe checkpoint data. See anybody? Like, yes. And you know what? We're gonna. This what the hell's casual auto? I don't know. I was thinking we're just gonna go casual. What's casual son? Uh, okay. Will it give me a description if I select it? I don't know. Uh, oh, Are we gonna take that risk? Vanquish. No, it doesn't. <laughs> Vanquish. <laughs> All right. What the fuck is this? All right. The arse or augmented reaction suit. So they straight up start you off the tutorial. Oh. It'll have that many buttons. Well, hi Nathan Drake. No, oh, this is way before Nathan Drake. He looks like him, though. No, he doesn't. Sam, how's the view on your monitor? How Metal Gear of you. <laughs> Looking good. The scenery's a little bland, though. This is... All right. Let's proceed with functionality testing. Yeah! Let's go! We're starting with electro-optical targeting systems <laughs> calibration. Sam, I'm going to display a virtual Wait target. A minute. Try to follow it visually. No, Sam, talk again. Oh, you're trying to point point a voice actor? I oh. thought it was David Hayter. No, it's not Metal... It's not... It's not Solid Snake. It's not. Damn it. I'm pretty sure, anyway. If things seem backwards, let me know, and I'll adjust the optical nerve sensors. Okay. Got it. You know, this is a real pain in the ass. I actually know that might be David Hayter. <laughs> that or he's... That or it's like... Just we really want you to sound like David Hayter. Go mm -hmm. with that. Open the operator manual. Return to tutorial menu. Control type. Buttons! Yeah, boy. Yeah, this is why I started a new game. One of the reasons. Alright, um... Left trigger's aim. Activate IR mode. Must be combined with both tactical evade. Uh, LB is boost. Boost. Smoke break while in cover. <laughs> Fire a weapon is RB. Was this uh, seriously RT. just Platinum right. trying to make a uh, Metal Gear Google. game? It's way more action-packed than a Metal Gear game. It is a third-person shooter. Well, they did make Revengeance. <laughs> they did. Uh, Star is pause, Y is throw a grenade, B is melee attack, A is tactical evade. Wait, is this was before Revengeance, wasn't it? Yeah, oh yeah, it was way before Revengeance. I wonder if this is just something they showed to him. It's like, look, we can do a Metal Gear game. Alright. True. You know I know what I'm doing, so let's do something different. No, it's What's not, David. <laughs> So we're gonna go through the tutorial real quick. To get to the bar, but we've got a lot to go over. Passing full control to you now. Blah 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 blah. Uh. You know, this is a real pain in the ass. How many times? Oh wait, I think I already did this. It's important we have baselines, Gideon. Just because Sam you can read a manual doesn't mean you know what you're doing. Just because you can read a manual doesn't mean you know what you're doing. True. You know I know what I'm doing, so let's do something different. What's on today's test schedule? My bad. All right, so it's not Look, neither of the I first two. I know you're in a rush to get to the bar, but we've got a lot to go over. 
Passing full control to you now. All right, let's get the let's get let's get it on. Let's give our all-powerful power suit over movement. to a drunkard. Here we go. Go ahead and give us some basic rotational movement readings. Bead. Look how fast that is. No? Yeah. Platinum. Skeletal actuators functioning nominally. We're going to get readings on boost limitation. And boost. Whenever you it looks so cool. Alright. Yeah, yeah. This is what I love how dumb this game is. You can do this all the time. Boost! What the fuck? <laughs> That is not a good boost. You're wearing down your suit. Nope. It's fine. On our current reactor design. The suit's cooling system can't keep up with that output level. It's causing some temporary performance loss, especially in the skeletal action boost. That's so stupid. It's great. Are you uh, on your knees while you're doing it? Too? Yeah. And I'm going to be doing it all the time. Elena, let's move on before Frank reads us the Project Grant chapter and verse. Yeah, fuck authority. <laughs> I could, I think I could boost while dodging too. Firing systems. Proceed with test. Affirmative. Shoot the gun. Virtual target. Do you get, do you get any melee weapons? Yeah, I don't think so. Uh, but you'll see what melee is like in a minute. So yeah, I just. I can reload it. Yeah. But there's also an aim. There we go. Yeah. Left trigger. Aim. Why would I shoot without aiming? Yeah. But then again, I can do. Woo! <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> oh, platinum. Why do I use the recoil control aim on function to increase accuracy? All right. Yeah, it's much faster. This guy thinks he's so cool, but I don't know. Recoil compensators are on and functioning normally. You can't suppress the recoil anymore? <sighs> Sam, your weapon isn't exactly stock. I know. Look how many weapons I have. Changing blade mode. Four. <laughs> Let's try firing something different. Sorry, okay, weapon two. Uh, huh? Uh, oh, okay, here, weapon. Oh, okay, I was on weapon two. Yeah. This is weapon one. We're still working on expanding the number of configurations stored in memory. An LMG. And here's the shotgun. Goody. That being said, go ahead and activate the scanner. And Goody, you're playing look, Destiny. And again. look how, look how the weapon changes. Isn't that cool? That's that is cool. We pick up exchange. Okay, what do I? Okay, let's get rid of the LMG for this. Any weapons when placed currently equipped, I would pick up the same type of weapon when we'll finishing ammunition. Ratchet clank. Actually, I was gonna say, uh... It bounces. Oh. Well, initially, I was and gonna... And it auto-seeks targets. <laughs> <laughs> so... Yeah. Initially, I was gonna say, uh... Dead Space. A little bit. Yeah. The Ripper. Ripper-chan. Ripper-chan, you're the... You're the best wife of... Jesus! Look how big that is. The Iron Gall Gallahorn isn't exactly small, either. Upgrade. upgrade! So, depending on what weapon you're currently holding, you pick up an upgrade for it. Upgrade will upgrade the current weapon via the blades that increase its in various ways. Picking up the same weapon already carrying the max amount of ammunition will allow you to proceed to the upgrade path for that weapon. So, picking up ammo picking up yeah. will help upgrade a gun. Blade can only replicate what already exists. Even the imperfections. I like this gun. Now we're going to check the grenade mounts. Grenade. Hmm. EMP emitter will simply say we'll start it for moving a limited period of time. I wonder what kind of enemies I'll be fighting if I have EMP grenades. Robots. So that was an EMP grenade. That is a huge blast radius. Oh yeah. It's very effective to enemies hiding behind cover. So, I don't think this guy would do too well against, uh... Alright. Uh, Sam. 
So you're curious about the melee. Yeah. We need to get the melee's the awesome. We can push the actuators. So you know I had boosts in my legs. Yeah. I also have them in my arms. Our friends at the Pentagon were happy to lend us a brand new piece of equipment. Electromagnetic armor. Punch it as much as you'd like, Sam. Punch it as much as you like. Woo! Confirming electromagnetic reaction. But it changes depending on the gun. The reaction force, a second to cool. So that was with the assault rifle. So I'm gonna switch to the heavy machine gun. Punch it again. Nothing beats the Looks like you still so we go to you, Sam. the shotgun. Damn. It's just a backhand. Hmm. Hang on. I know there was cool melee stuff. If I switch to... It? Grenade? Oop. Oop. Huh. Hang on. Let's try that again. We need to get some data on how far we can push the actuators. I'm releasing an object to test your impact. It's because I have a target. Hmm. If I'm not... Not at the target. There are combos. Magnetic armor. Punch it as much as you'd like, Sam. And then uh Huh. You boost into them. So that's a kick. Okay, it's always a kick when you boost out of it. Mm. And then there's... Confirming electromagnetic reaction. Sam, give the electromagnetic Love engine the generating the reaction force a second to cool. I could have there are other so melee attacks, the but... Maybe there are. There's just more, more guns. guns. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Yeah, that boost. I have to manage it. Not a big fan of the helmet. I like the helmet. Eh. Don't like it? No. Not what I expect on my power armor. Nothing beats the old one. Oh, those shotguns are fucking back. Looks like you yeah. got some bite in you, Sam. And, uh, it's not letting me switch to grenades. Basically, grenades kind of always on. You can see it's red. Yeah. The red one's always equipped, so I, and because because grenades a different button, I just hit Y and throw one. <laughs> All right, last one, AR mode. Guess what that means? Sam, we took the measurements we made of your mm. brain's sympathetic nervous system. Augmented reality. Suits synaptic emitters to augment your reactions under fire. Augmented reactions. Doesn't really make walking around with electrodes all day any more comfortable. Small price to pay for having elevated synaptic activity during critical fight or flight situations. Will you two quit bickering like a couple of MIT grad students? Now let's proceed <laughs> with our test of the R's functionality. Hmm. Let me know when you're ready, Sam. Hey, AR. <laughs> they tell me how to do it? Like that. Oh, it's get hurt. Taking critical damage automatically trigger AR mode until your suit overheats, allowing you to react to imminent danger. I finished hmm. implementing the manual trigger system you asked for. The system will automatically lock if it detects any life-threatening imbalances in your hormonal levels due to extended use. During evade left trigger activate AR mode Jeez. and what if I Woo! bullet time yeah this mode will allow you to intercept attacks such as missiles however like boost this mode will overheat your suit so use it wisely huh we're good very well. I think that's enough for today's test. I've got the controls. Good job, Sam. You got the controls? <laughs> sure. Lena, you up for some lucky? 
<laughs> yep, for some luckies. Y'all whore. Mm -hmm. I don't know the history behind Vanquish. I just know it's a fun game. The history behind Vanquish is platinum. It's all you really need. Hey, platinum made a fun game. Director Shinji Mikami. Yeah. Uh, what else has he done? I have no idea. Isn't he... Isn't that Metal Gear? Metal Gear is Kojima. Oh, right. Shin... No, Shinji Mikami is uh, Devil May Cry. That's why. That's why this game's great. <laughs> Look at everyone having such a nice time. It's such a nice day in oh the park. Oh boy. How do we fuck this all up? Oh. Just... Space, space. cannon! Yeah, it's... Char's counterattack. Okay, let's go. Look at the space cannon. Look how big it is. Look how slowly it charges. It's every series of Gundam. Except G. <laughs> Except G. G didn't have space cannons. It did? Uh, it didn't. Uh, it didn't. No. Well, I, I can't remember. I do remember Master Gundam. Oh, the little Gundam girl with the balloon. Not Master I do remember Devil Gundam went to space. Everyone goes to space at some point. Yeah. Oh, join. Hey, what laser. do you think that laser's gonna do? Oh no! Not what? our cell phones. Oh, that's also not good. Oh, I... Why were yeah. they standing around looking at the? Oh, Whoa, Jesus! Shit. Yeah, look at that. No one knows what, what to heck? do. Yeah. First person look at it. Oh boy! Yeah, he's just in his trapped in his car. Oh, that, oh boy! All right. Oh. I think the villain, the antag, is using microwave. Is using that thing. I think that's if the it's boiling. Yeah, because it's awesome. a giant microwave. It's theme. a giant microwave laser. Isn't that cool? I mean, when yeah. do you see that? Ooh, woof. That's too good. Ooh. I gotta save the world with my sick spacesuit from the microwaves. <laughs> hey, there are survivors. We. I didn't blow up from microwave radiation. Good job. The Russian star now welcomes you to the inauguration of a new Russian. Oh, what do you oh, know? Boy. It's Russian. It's the Ruskies. It's the Ruskies. Why did we let them build that? I think they'll explain it. No, you can't get away with building that. There is but one way. We would see it. Destruction of New York City. Why New York? Why not DC? Your complete and unconditional surrender. <laughs> because we gotta give them a sporting and chance. What, and that was just San Francisco, that first one. My fellow Americans. President's a woman, ain't that progressive? Yeah, but look what happened. <laughs> San Francisco will I'm never kidding. Be the same. And the toll of our war has increased by countless men, women, and children. Oh, this is an ongoing war. With Russia, I guess. And we just let them build a giant space laser. We say firmly, we will not <laughs> negotiate with those who wish to destroy us. Our strength is unmatched. No, seriously, this bothers me. Gundam gets away with it because it's not directly above Earth. It is. It has to be flown in to Earth before it blows something up. I think they'll explain it. I don't know. All right, so yeah, here we go. Here's America's fleet. Is currently under the control of those responsible for the coup. His voice, you can tell. Yeah. The operation is being led by a red known as Zeitzen. Oh yeah. Dempsey, so good to see you. DARPA sent him to come along with us. DARPA. Wait, no. 
DARPA sent us. In. No, 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 no. That is <laughs> that's a direct correlation to goddamn the DARPA chief. Yeah, Metal Gear. Yeah. We will stop that from happening. This is basically like Mikami being like, oh yeah, I can make a high <laughs> high level tech to you. A level tactical action game too. Don't seem too fond of you. Lena Inova. Directly from POTUS and SecDef. These guys are just interested in marking their territory. Sam. Nobody likes me because I have the super suit. They're all super jelly of my super suit. That and I'm kind of an asshole. Sam's just like everyone's super jelly of my super suit. Fuck them. They already did. Sam looks is so weird. Yeah. This place, hell, <laughs> even this suit runs on his energy designs. He's too valuable to kill. I know. Runs off microwaves. Man, microwaves are awesome. <laughs> <laughs> Could kick your ass. Just blows. Just turns around and blows smoke in his face. Scratched. You did get some training in this thing, right? Yeah, about 15 minutes of it. Simulators are very thorough. Yeah, would you say that simulator we went through went through about every possible situation we can go to? We could use no. Subject of DARPA. It's reason we're all casual. <laughs> this is a platinum game. Even casual can be bad sometimes. My cigarette! Oh, you dick, I was gonna smoke that. What the fuck, man? <laughs> You're not allowed to smoke on the ship. <laughs> Sam's be like, oh, I'm gonna. Wait a minute. I'm gonna. <laughs> Wait, does that take down your health? I don't see. Uh, I think my health bar is kind of like gears. Oh. So yeah, here's another thing. I could just do this. I could run like everyone else, or I could. Woo! <laughs> oh shit! Oh, good thing you uh, didn't hit that. <laughs> that was a this was a cutscene. It automatically stopped me. <laughs> Halo would have let you get killed by that. Uh huh. Oh, that guy. Well, mm, sucks for him. <clears throat> also, like Metal Gear, I did like how many seconds of gameplay before it cuts. <clears throat> Getting a shit wrecked. Ooh. Or we're wrecking their shit. I can't tell. We're wrecking theirs. <clears throat> I have to get on board the microwave. How death stars of you. This just this reminds me of Halo. Oh yeah. Everybody running onto this. Are we going to deliver back their bomb? Maybe. Dude, I don't. I didn't play this game for very long. I didn't get very far. Yeah. And I played on normal, and I was like, I died so much on normal. I was like, okay. <laughs> There are like like the only cry. There are secrets and collectibles, but I don't know where they are. Mm -hmm. Or like upgrades and stuff. The, the ways those things first when I first look at those things, I kind I kind got the image of elites. <laughs> Bungie didn't have anything to do with this. No, this is a Sega and Platinum collaboration. Hell yeah, but 
Like, you uh, can see where inspirations were that, taken. Uh, yeah, oh yeah, well it's sci-fi. I can't wait for Bayonetta 3. God, I hope. I hope. It's just a remake. Man. What about No More Heroes? The new, that new one. Still the play the first. Yeah. Better watch an OP. I'm surprised you haven't uh, just asked to borrow mine. I need to borrow yours. Well, the new No More Heroes isn't gonna be like uh, hack and slash. There's gonna be a bit of that, but Travis gets sucked into a video game. Well, a uh, a SNES classic, if you will. Oh, really? Yeah. So it's gonna be multiple different games that you go there. I think Shovel Knight is in it. Kojima and Suda Fifty One need to collaborate on a game. It would be the weirdest game ever, but it would be awesome. Get sweary in there too. That's sweary. Nothing would make sense. What's sweary though? D3 or D4? Oh, okay. Yeah, D4. Yeah, I need to play that. Well, there's only one episode of it. They, it was never completed. I uh, believe. Oh yeah. He's done other shit. Oh no, the ship crashed. Oh shit, better move! <clears throat> Where am I right now? I don't know. Jeez. Yeah, he's so cool. There, there you are. are. God, that's awesome. Now, wouldn't have the division been funner like this? Yes. We aren't gonna get through it like this, sir. Flank around the enemy position. Where can I? Oh, I see. Woo! I think Warframe was supposed to be this. Yeah. Look, keep an eye out for you secret. You should be able to flank the enemy from behind. Yeah. Good luck. Yeah, if I have a health bar, I don't know. They're not showing it. Fuck you, enemies! Yeah. I think I flanked them. I think I flanked them good. Hey, when does Climax Climax Fighters come out again? No. Oh that's, wait, that's a friend. Yeah, that's your Lieutenant Throne. <laughs> when does what come out again? Climax Fighters? December. Yeah. Oh. Oh yeah, we're definitely making a video of that. Don't worry. Wait, what am I doing? Fuck as I know. Uh, what? There it is. Why does that get in the way? Oh, Platinum, you're too it's, good. It's a cover shooter, that's why. I have to use the cover. Yeah, friendly ship coming down. Okay. I feel like I've taken out a lot of the enemy. All by myself. See, that's the friendly. That's big robot. Yeah, but I can slow down time. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> this was much more difficult on normal. Kind of like how the difficulty levels change between uh, easy and normal for Don't Make Cry. It's kind yeah. of like that level of difficulty. God, I missed Don't Make Cry. Yep. This kind of just gives you that feel, only with guns. Yeah. I don't know. Eh, gunners are fine, but if I want to play something like that, I just get pop in Destiny. Mm -hmm. Destiny, Destiny's not as cool as this. Oh no! I wish Destiny was cool. Oh yeah, this. no. If Destiny let me do this dumb shit, I would do it. without a cooldown. What's this? Shotgun. Ah. I have a shotgun. So now if More I... More ammo. Yeah. And that upgraded it. See the little 
yeah. symbol on there. It's now private. Whatever. I don't know the military symbols, I'm guessing. Uh, I don't know. Call of Duty has not taught me well. Never mind you, don't make right. Yeah. Alright, that was the first episode of Vanquish. See ya, guys. Yeah. If you like this video, please like and subscribe.